So I was watching an old movie the other day and saw the classic Colored by Technicolor credit and then I wondered what exactly is Colored by Technicolor? What, what does it mean? Like, do they colorize a black and white film like we've seen them do with some photographs? Or did they invent like a new film that allows colors to be revealed? Well, I've decided to quit wondering and look it up. So I'm going to share my findings with you and hopefully you find this as interesting as I did. So I searched YouTube and found a video that I think describes it really well, but I think the cool part starts at 523 where you can see the huge camera, I mean huge camera, that they used for filming Wizard of Oz. But in short, if you don't feel like watching the entire 11 minute video, what they did is they put a prism behind the lens and it split the image into three, which they simultaneously recorded on three separate film rolls. Then they dyed each film roll the opposite colors that are needed for colorization for movies, which are red, blue, and green. And then they transferred that dye, which is called the dye transfer process. And then they put all three film rolls on top of each other to get color. And that is what creates the color that we all get to enjoy today. I do recommend watching at least at the timestamp 240 to see their visual description of this process. Okay, time for a joke. What happened when the red ship crashed into the blue ship? The crew was marooned. Okay, that's it for today, guys. See you next time. Don't forget to send in your photos and your jokes to be featured. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and share with all your buddies. <laughs> Bye, guys.